Good day everyone, this is Ali here. After a long time I've been not doing any videos, but we got a phone which is the Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. Now, unfortunately, it's a friend's phone and he forgotten the pattern. So the phone is disabled completely, you can't get into it because he forgot the password and the pattern. Now he's got a lot of important information and data within it and he doesn't want to lose it. So to come up to get this problem sorted, we would need to remove the screen lock or the pattern or the password. To do so, we would need certain softwares and probably the best way. So what we need to do first, at first at the very beginning, that you got a few options. First, if your phone is rooted and the USB debugging is enabled, then the, the, the entire process is 50% easier. So in, in, in our case, it is not that case because it's not rooted and it's not, the USB debugging is not enabled. So that's making a lot of hard work for us. Um, there are other ways that you could do this way. Um, but what I do is I go to this uh, software and choose the <clears throat> the correct model. Now the problem is we would need to inst install the TWRP on it to be able to get into the um, recovery mode. So to do so we would need to flash it via Odin's. You can get the Odin's from Google. The 3.10 or 3.12 uh, is the right um, or the current version but it doesn't matter you can use any of these model so once we do that we, we need to put our phone into download mode so into download mode to copy lock is on the, the 12 file will not flash because it will tell you that the the if RP lock is on, in that case, you won't be able to flash it. Uh, the, the, what happens is the security will block the, the 12 file to flash on your phone. So basically, you will need to remove the, the um, FRP lock before you can literally flash the 12 file. That's one thing, to remove it, because this is taking a bit of time now. I just wanted to explain how things works here. So once we are, uh, we got these two files, audience and twelve file. <clears throat> we come up to here and we connect the phone in download mode, and we select the Odin and we just flash it. It will literally in download mode. Uh, just press the volume down, home button, and power button at the same time. There we go for ten seconds at least. Um, so if you count it, it's going to take up to 10 seconds and you will come up to this first page. There we go. So you would need to press the volume up and you are in download mode. That's it. So once you are in download mode, what you need to do is now select the correct file, which is, there we go. So if you start flashing, as I said to you, before it, it says not to reboot, you can just Untick it, but leave it now because it's it makes life easier. So press start. So once it's um, at the starting point, you would need to press volume up, home button, and the power button at the same time. It should literally take you to the recovery mode. There we go. So we are in the recovery mode. Now from here, now uh, from here on, what you could do is you could uh, literally root your um, phone. Uh, so how are we going to do now? You, you would need a USB SD card uh, and copy the um, file called, if I bring up this folder here, there we go, if I bring up this folder and copy the um, SuperZoo uh, folder into the SD card and connect it to your phone uh, what we're gonna do now because we don't we got this install it super zoo there you go now this is gonna install the super zoo on your phone which means your phone will be 
rooted from now on. Oh, now we come up to this point where we can <clears throat> uh, recently uh, the correct. Here we go. So once we are here, you can see reset FRP lock restriction. Now you, you get these three options where whether you want to do with uh, URAC cable or UART cable or ADB or uh, via rooted. So you got these three options. So I've done this via URAC because uh, this is much easier where we, I can connect this here. Look to, to right in here. <clears throat> and then we just do the same process uh, as we did before. Now, because the FRP has been removed from my phone, um, let me show you. I don't need to do this one, as you can see. Far away, where, where's the focus? So if I see FRP lock is off, uh, we've removed that one successfully. 